I want to talk about something today that is near and dear to my heart. Now, this has been ongoing for a little while. This has been a story that's been out in the gaming world and people have been following this. As you guys know, Overwatch has had its fair share of issues, mainly being that Blizzard is being sued or being taken to court in the state of California. And right now, it doesn't look like they're doing too well with Overwatch 2. Overwatch, for me, was like one of the first games that came out that I played on the PC. When I first built my PC back in, who knows when, back in the Dizay. And I had a friend that helped me build my PC. We got that game loaded up. It was pretty much the first game that I played. <clears throat> a, lot of, a lot of late nights spent on Overwatch. And some of my favorite characters that came out, you know, over the past few years have been Doomfist or past year or so. Ash was really cool. Her alt is super OP, still a good character. And so I've been really looking forward to getting back into it. Overwatch 2 has been kind of in the works and everything. And I don't know what y'all's opinions are on Overwatch 2 right now. It seems as though Overwatch 2 is losing some traction. Mainly being because I just read today that Overwatch 2 loses its lead hero designer, which is no big deal, right? Because without Overwatch's characters, Overwatch really isn't a game. It isn't something that we want to play. One of the biggest draws of Overwatch is its character designs, plot lines, storylines, bringing out new characters and everything uh, is a big deal. So without this guy, uh, Jeff, let me get this right. I think it's Jeff Gooden, Goodman. Uh, might be, he spells it weird. He spells it with this weird G-E-O-F-F. -F. Like who spells their name that way? No offense. Jeff, I think that's his name, Jeff Goodman. But um, he's helped design and balance out the hero since the game inception. Essentially, with him leaving, where does that leave us? So it makes me a little nervous that Overwatch 2 isn't going to be a quality product, nor something that I want to play. I don't know if you guys feel the same way. Overwatch 2, is it something you're looking forward to? Is it something that you're giving up on? Is Blizzard kind of out the window for you with this lawsuit and sort of the things that it's gone through? I don't know. I don't know where that leaves us. Um, you know, it's a official release date, at least what I'm looking online, is it's supposed to release October 4th, 2022. Is that going to come our way? It says, I'm reading an article on PC Gamer right now. When is Overwatch 2's release date? Overwatch 2 enters early access October 4th. Are you guys looking forward to it? I wanna know if people are actually looking forward to this game. I will probably play this game because nostalgia, I feel like I'm not gonna forget those days that I played this game, which they were late nights, staying up, playing Junkrat till the middle of the night and getting play of the games. Cause you know, your boy was nice and his ult, it was kind of like a no-brainer. It was kind of a cheat, cheat code, you know? Are you guys looking forward to Overwatch 2? Are you not looking forward to Overwatch 2? Are you just not gonna play it at all? I kind of want to see everybody's opinion on that because for me, it is nostalgic. 